Yo guys, welcome to the no the fuck, I had to, <laughs> I wanted to make a nice <laughs> and then I <laughs> made a mistake. Uh welcome to the last riding vlog from this tour. It's the last day we're going to bluff today. To and then we are finished. We are finished. We are finished. It's unbelievable kind of. I'm not sure actually how many days it was, maybe 40 something. Um, you will see it in the title, but I don't. Um, yeah, it's crazy. Last riding day today, it's 110k maybe. Because I go through Invercargill, or via Invercargill, which is a bit of a detour because I want to buy some f food at Countdown. Um, yeah, that's actually the reason I want to go to Countdown. Um, because down in Bluff is just like a little four squares kind of thing, so I was like, nah, no chance. Um, go to Invercargill, it's not too big, big detour. Um, yo, so let's just enjoy riding today. I'm looking pretty good, pretty prepared. It's windy outside, you can see. I think it's... I'm gonna have a good headwind, actually. That's what I think. But that's fine. I can do it. Uh, yeah. Let's just ride today. Last day. Enjoy watching this video. I'm gonna enjoy riding. So, yeah, man. Let's go. Maybe Fortress. I'm not sure if it's the right name, but we're like 50k from Invercargill, and then 75 from Bluff. Yeah, so that's great. Not too far anymore. I'm just about to collect some rubbish. I saw some rubbish over here. I was actually hoping to talk to a friend now, but. I can't find any Wi-Fi connection here in Fort Rose or Anobe even when the map is saying that here is a Wi-Fi connection uh, which is a bit unfortunate Pull back. Yo guys, I'm in Invercargill, got some lunch now, one baguette with avocado, cucumber and tomato, it's gonna be awesome. Uh, yeah, let's just eat it, I'm hungry as. Yes.
that's it. I don't know what what to say. It's that's it. Four thousand kilometers riding New Zealand. Finished. Over. I don't know what I'm feeling. I think it's time to settle down. I don't know what to say. <laughs> I've done it. I made some exercise, uh, like some stretching exercise and some yoga headstand and uh, I'm just a bit coming down which is great and for a swim as well it's freezing cold I just want to quickly show you my bags because I realized I haven't done that before uh, I haven't showed you my my actually my actual setup what I carry I think all the stuff I got with me we do maybe another time Oh, uh, and today I'll just show you all, I got four, five bags actually, five bags with me. So, here, that's my saddle bag. All, all four bags are from Apidura. And the last one is my backpack, which is not from Apidura. So, here, a saddle bag. Here's most of my clothing and, and some bike tools and that, yeah. Yeah, a lot of sand flies. Um, here's my frame bag. Yeah, because it's in the frame, it's called frame bag. What a genius. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's my frame bag. Here's uh, my computer in and most of my electronic stuff. Yeah, and here's a book inside as well. And yeah. Uh, one thing, because once I haven't didn't pack that bag or pretty well, so I managed to make a little hole in here because it went uh, slipped like down on the tie. Um, with that bag, I managed to break this zip here. I just uh, when I was trying it out, I just packed too much stuff in there, so I wrote the full full period with a broken zip, and then. We come to this little bag here. There is like a map inside. There used to be my phone inside, but it's broken now, so there's no phone. And here I managed that to to have that down on my tires as well, quite a bit here. Um, and then there's this bag. Here you can see some mandarins, apple, and an onion as well. <laughs> Uh, here I got most of my, yeah, there's mostly food inside normally and my jandals uh, Yeah, and with all the bags I always need to pack them properly Properly or proper properly properly um, I need to pack them properly properly pop <laughs> however <laughs> um, That otherwise I I am struggling paddling when the frame bank is not not packed properly, like the pedals go um, on the touch the little uh, touch the touch the back, which is not really great. Uh, and with the other two bags, when they're not well packed, then they go slip down on the tires. So that's my setup. All the stuff I have with me. Maybe or maybe we do that in another video. Um, yeah, not in the vlogs kind of thing. Uh, yeah, so so I've done all my touring. Um, really interesting time. Mostly just about myself and to figure out what I want to do myself and who I am. And it was interesting. I'm I'm actually just chilling here. 
it's a lovely place here. Yeah? Let's have some seaweed. <laughs> no, just kidding. Yeah, we're going now probably around to the hostel. Get some... Uh, I forgot tomatoes on the in the supermarket uh, when I sh was shopping in Vukaga, so I'm going to get here some tomatoes. Maybe a little snack as well. I just stopped the vlog here. Thank you for watching all my my vlogs or the vlogs you watched to follow my journey. If you haven't watched haven't watched all my videos, you should definitely check them out. It's finished. It's been a great trip. It's been a tough trip. And um, yeah. Bye bye. Check out my latest video, my uh, my other videos and like and subscribe like my this video subscribe my channel see you later guys i don't know if that's nice yo guys even when i finished my tour i still was keen on collecting a bit of rubbish i see rubbish bin over there going thrown in there